doing our blood spatter lab. It is two parts. Okay, you're each going to get, each group is going to get two different sheets. There's one part where you're going to be exploring the difference in height. So you're going to have to measure different heights. You're going to fill out this data table. See this data table? You're going to start with 25 centimeters, then go up to 50. Once it gets past that, that's about this high. Then it's going to be a little too hard to do it from the table, so you're going to have to move your paper to the ground. So you have two sets of data together. The changing of the height difference and what that does to blood spatter size, and then the texture of the surface that it drops on. Okay, so two sheets per lab, just one per group though as far as, you know, each sheet. You don't all have to fill this out. Put it like in the middle of the paper so this person's getting on the... Wait, wait, put it in like the middle of the paper. Well, Alright. Alright. We gotta measure it. We have smaller measures. Measure it. How? Like, length? We have to measure it. Alright. So that's like one and a half. They're all basically one and a half. One and a half? One and a half centimeters. Ooh, our satellite theory seems to be coming true. Uh, I cut it on me. Okay. So this is two centimeters. A little less than two centimeters. Two centimeters. So basically two centimeters. A little less than like one point. No, these two are both two centimeters. This one is just a little smaller. So two centimeters. Two centimeters. Somewhere like air bubbles. Uh, yeah. And then at 200 and then 22.